Because I looks, knew this wasn't gonna, like, the same. Restrain you. It's like when he, Eddie Murphy dry, dressed up as a white man. He found out that that white people don't have to pay for their newspapers. You're a girl. It's a different experience for you. You just stride right in. You say, hello, I'm an you're attractive woman. You're telling me, I'm right, going straight to the genius bar. You're telling bar. me if you start walking to the genius bar, someone will physically restrain you. Excuse me, sir. Bring you down to the floor Excuse in me, a sir. headlock and say, what do you uh, want? You don't need a headlock. They just say, wait, I have to talk to you first, and then you can go to the genius bar. You never, don't have that experience? Never. No. I think that's a little much. Actually, I'd say, excuse you. Talk to the hand. You yeah. just keep walking. Face don't want to hear that. Anyway. Nice. Weird. It's like two different worlds. Yeah. So. It's always been a different world for you attractive young women. Come on. An old grandmother. Anyway, what you do, what you're going to do now is update your issue into um, an iPad application. Some sort of app. It's for, it's for the store. It's not for you. Yeah, they, they'll be doing that. Yeah. Then an algorithm mm. will help um, will help put customers into queue mm. based on priorities. So, for example, if you're like, oh, my gosh, I just shattered my iPhone screen. That's like a pretty high priority. Um, you go right to the front of the line. Ra yeah, rather than someone's like, I have a question about iCloud. Back of the line. Yeah. Now, there's something about this that bothers me a little bit because... It's not first come, first serve. Right. They're deciding some people are more important than other people. And the thing is, is that if you have what Apple deems to be a minor iCloud issue, it's a little insulting if you're like, I, I think it's a big issue. And I, my issue? Yeah, it's my issue. And you're kind oh, of like, sorry. you're kind of dumb. It, like, it almost makes me feel like if you're at the bottom of the queue and you have to have all these like shattered, who are the shattered screen people? They're the people who've got butterfingers. This is like the emergency room at the hospital. Mm -hmm. When you go in, they say, and by the way, this is why you should always say, I'm having trouble breathing, and I only can smile with half my face. Yeah. And then you can get Please seen. look at my ankle that might be slightly... Yeah, don't say, oh, my knee hurts. <laughs> You'll be sitting there for hours. So it's called triage. Mm -hmm. It is the deciding decision on who to treat first. I think it's interesting, but we got to make the point that you still could go online no matter what stupid problem you have. Right and get an appointment and then just show up at that time and you'll get seen right away. This is only for walk-ins. And, I mean, as we see with every single time iPads or iPhones are released, there are plenty of people who still do that. Well, I think one of the plenty reasons of they said they want to do this is that stores are jammed with people milling around waiting for their genius appointment. Yeah. They don't, they don't want that kind of thing. Especially since they're trying to make the, yeah, the Apple stores look different. Right. And, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a new era we'll see. for Apple stores. We'll see. I would love to say that I'm never in a genius bar. I'm never really in a genius bar because I have not been able to figure out an issue. But I have been in a genius bar once or twice. Butterfingers? With a much? shattered screen. Are you a Butterfingers? I like Butterfingers. You don't deserve to be in the front of the line, Bis Butterfingers. But I will be. You will because be. Apple says, ooh, you're in a real pinch, aren't you? Yep. Yeah. You're a pickle. You're in a pickle. Uh, do we want to talk about how Apple is the, like, biggest company by market cap, like, twice so, as much as Exxon, which is that's the second biggest company? So they've been the biggest company for a while. Right. They, they are now so much bigger than the number two company. They're actually twice as big as the number two company. Right. They're double the size, the market cap of Exxon. And remember when, like, Apple, like, topped Exxon for, like, a minute, and, and like, it went back down, and everyone was like, oh, my God, oh, my God. That was, like, four years ago. For five seconds, Apple was the most valuable More than twice as valuable. No, it's like, eh. Was, they let, they've lapped them. It's starting to get, like, it's almost just funny. It's like, I can't even get, well, I don't get up in arms about stuff like that anyway, because I like Apple, but it's like, price. even for the people who get up in arms about the stuff, it's like, it just, I don't, you know, it's just... But remember, this is based on stock price. Right. And the stock right now is high because... It, the, Expectations. The, yeah, you, the the old adage Great is quarter. buy on the rumor, right? Sell on the on the whatever. on the crappy reality. Yeah. <laughs> so buy on the rumor, sell on the crappy reality. Yeah, that's yeah. what they say. Analysts. I went to analyst school. What? No, I just kidding. I don't you should know. have. I don't know. You'd be that, good. I don't know what that is. Nah, you should, I'm is not, there a school for analysts? I don't know, but I bet Linda would know. Apple if there was. Apple has gone down a couple of bucks uh, on Friday, one hundred twenty-eight dollars, but it's still up so much more than it was, and it's still worth seven hundred fifty-nine point six three billion dollars, which is almost double Exxon. Oh my gosh! But again, that's only stock price. 
Right. Of course, they are the most profitable co company in the history of the world. Yeah. And with the watch, gosh, who it, knows? It will be very interesting. It will be. It will be. With money interesting. like that, you could probably buy any kind of underwear you wanted. Yeah. You know, it's a. Uh, is that a bad it's, it's funny because <laughs> she's trying to make it good. Watch, this is why Sarah is such a pro. Oh come on! Why no, is that funny? It up. <laughs> I know. It, it, Sometimes we want to break the fourth wall and let them see the, the sausage. It's the funny thing. because you have heard of Bitcoin exchanges. I have. But you didn't know that some of us pay for things with our underwear. <laughs> no, wait, don't. wait a minute! Oh, I don't even. No, no, it's a bad image. Let me tell you this. What what my point is, I need some new underwear. Oh, <laughs> you actually. Because I've got stock in Apple, and my underwear drawer is empty. Are you, are you drunk on strawberry yogurt pretzels? Don't give me Is any that of what's those. going on? I ate them all. They're gone. I don't know. I tried. You set me up in a weird way. You were a bad pitcher. <laughs> you know. I'm. Wait a minute. Let's I'm try this. Let's try that again. And I'm just trying to I catch know. this wild you know, pitch. It was a wild pitch. It's not your fault. It's not a passed ball. It's a wild pitch. Let's start over. Okay. You know, I wonder what color underwear you're wearing today. Oh, well, they are black. <laughs> okay, that didn't Why do you ask? Because me undies makes that boring old black <laughs> underwear uh, something extra special oh. at meundies.com. M e u n d i e s. These are the, this is the literally the best underwear. You'll look just like that. This is the best underwear I have ever worn. Well, how made much from, fun they're having. Made from modal, which is a, a, a kind of an interesting fiber made out of birch trees from the Austrian Alps. It's very soft. Beach, beechwood, not birch. That one, that's from Fifty Shades of Grey. Beechwood trees in the Austrian Alps. Were you wearing those black ones? Those are cute. Uh, for men and for women. They're, they're, Those well, are they're, cute. They're, yeah, that's that's well, it's one of the two. Let's just put it that way. One mm -hmm. of the two. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, me undies not only made from a really beautiful soft fabric. There's the modal, uh, but it's also environmentally friendly, which is kind of neat. Low carbon footprint, CO2 neutral process, saves water and en energy due to their spun dyed fiber process, which also means, by the way. That the the color is fast. It does, you know, you could put your red underwear in with your white T-shirts. So you don't have to worry so much about. Oh, that's that. nice. I know. I like that. I hate separating. I'm really colors. glad of that. Yeah. But I also, like that. it's comfortable. It kind of conforms to your body without being tight. So it's you know what I'm gonna say. It's a little sexy. It's a little. It's cute. It's yeah. cute underwear, and it's it's fun. You can get all sorts of me on these patterns, all sorts of styles for men and women. Uh, they wick moisture away from your skin, so you always feel cool and stay cool. It's just, I don't know what it, you wear underwear a lot, like 90% of your life is spent in underwear. Mm -hmm. Why not have something comfortable, cute, cozy, and fun? And you can also see that they've got, like, especially for women, I really can't say much for the men's t-shirts because, these are well, cute. I'm not a man, but I I got a couple pairs, like the v-neck on the um, on the left-hand side, I got that in, in gray. Oh, it's so It's really, it's like so soft. So is that the one you got? Uh, yeah. That is beautiful. That's actually, yeah. The well, it's, oh, a, it's a great color, but um, and there's something about the fabric also that you know with uh, t-shirts like that. It's like, better than cotton. And the last thing you want to do is iron a t-shirt, right? Oh, yeah. And there's something about this fabric where it doesn't get rich the gone. same way. That one's gone. So it's not all modal. So it's, it's, it's a combed so. cotton thing. I think it, there must be some way that they, you know, they I don't know what combed cotton really means. Cause They're I doing something good. About it. But yeah, because I do this thing where I like roll up all my t-shirts in one of my drawers. And because I, That's need, what I, do I too. need more. I don't want to fold them, so I roll them. Yeah. yeah. But, they, but you still sometimes get creases that you don't want. And that yeah. t-shirt of all the t-shirts. You has just shake it out and yeah. it's boom. It's yeah, ready to go. It's good to go. Mm -hmm. French ter Terry sweatpants. Cute. Those are so cute. You cute. get the footies, the socks, the boot socks. All of it. And you're going to get 20% off and free shipping. 20% off and free shipping on your first order, even more if you buy a pack, which I would do. And don't worry, they guarantee you'll be happy or your first pair is free. 20% off when you go to meundies.com slash 
Twit. I, uh, look at those. They're fun. I just wander around the house in my underwear now because it's so cute. MeUndies.com. Look at that. Polka dots. Who doesn't love polka dots? MeUndies.com slash Twit. I'd show you mine right now. Big fan of polka dots. But I've been told not to. Ah, uh, well. We I didn't all, take that well, class. Yeah. They made me sign a thing. Mm, HR. Such a bummer. So, uh, have you heard that VLC is back in the iOS App Store? It comes, it goes, it goes, it comes, it comes, it goes, it comes, it comes, it goes. You don't know. You don't get a lot of, uh, you know, information on what's going on. But for those people who say, like, oh, VLC player, that's great. You should have it. Yeah, like, what's different? There's quite a few. But okay, so the I think the way that the history went is the VLC uh, had launched in the App Store and got pulled and then like w like triumphantly returned about two years ago, yeah. almost two years ago. And Strange format that you didn't have codecs for. Yep. It's like VLC player was just it was like it was like the, the least problematic of all of your options. And without knowing why Apple pulls it, I would guess that you just said the magic phrase, which is the codecs. Mm -hmm. So there are open source free codecs, but most codecs are actually owned by a company. Mm -hmm. And VLC was great because uh, on a desktop Mac or Windows. You download VLC, you'll get all the codecs, even the codecs that could play back DVDs. And that probably isn't an open source codec. And I would guess that the folks at Apple and VLC go back and forth about what codecs the VLC can put in there. And probably. So forth. They, and the other problem is, of course, it's a video player, which I don't think we've said yet. This is a right. video player. Right. And I think that Apple has always said, we don't want to duplicate functionality. We already have a video player. Mm -hmm. The problem is Apple's video player won't play back MKVs and mm -hmm. just oddball file formats that you would run into on the Internet. And VLC uh, will. You also can watch us from VLC. And a lot of our uh, most hardcore fans prefer to watch us through VLC than through our web pages using you know, it's always a problem on iOS because a lot of our partners like Ustream use Flash. So VLC is a great choice. Now, to use VLC with us, I would suggest going to wiki, W-I-K-I dot twit dot TV. There's a link there, how to watch, because you have to have the right URL. It changes, I think, from time to time and so forth. I'm thrilled. VLC is, uh, is back on, uh, here, let me just show you real quickly. On iOS, uh, it does allow you also to sync up to a desktop and play stuff through Wi-Fi, mm -hmm. uh, which is great. You can upload your media to Google Drive or Dropbox and play it that way as well, which it gives you more capabilities. So uh, it's f yeah, this they have is like really cool. support for G Drive now, right. native support for Plex for people who have Plex media servers. Really great for that. Yeah. free and open source. So get it from VideoLand dot or Inc or whatever it is, because that's the uh, that's the official uh, VLC. You know, when I got it, I. I think, I think, I think, I think that I just searched for VLC, and yeah, it's it's like the fourth See, VLC for that's iOS. that's deceptive. See, well, but it's, just look the at, first you know, two, just those sure, aren't real. That's correct, yeah. That's just make sure that you make sure that it's offered by Videoland. Videoland is the key. Yeah. That is, you know, like, VLC remote free. Nope. Wrong go. Yeah, I mean, I don't, I don't know who those are, and I don't know if they're bad, but I just, I just.